Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make soles for baby booties. I have different sizes here. I have 0 to 3, 3 to 6, 6 to 9, 9 to 12. For 0 to 3, you're going to use a G size hook. For 3 to 6, a H size hook. For 6 to 9, a I size hook. And for 9 to 12, a J size hook. As you can see, I have different booties. These are made out of 100% cotton. This is babies. There's a little Mary Jane slipper I made. I'm going to move this aside. I'm going to use the J size hook so I can show you how to do the soles of the booty. I also I'm going to use sugar and cream yarn which is 100%. I like using this yarn for babies, for baby booties in the summer cuz it's, you know, breathable for them not too hot, just perfect. This color is light blue. Okay. I already started. I already have my slip notch made. Okay. You could use, make your own knot, however you know how to make it. I make mine like this. It's easier for me and faster. Now, we're going to chain eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're going to make one chain. We're going to use this one to start. So you're going to wrap your yarn over the hook. You're going to a second loop. And do a half double crochet into each of the eight loops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, You're gonna have something looking like this. I'm gonna stretch it out so I can fall into place. Now, on the next loop, you're going to crochet four half double crochet into the same loop. This may look a little bit loose, but you know, it's just a tutorial. Some people do the no foundation chain. You know how to make that? You make eight of the no foundation chain. And then right next to it, you're going to start with four half double crochet one two three four now you're going to do half double crochet into the next six One, two, three, two, three, three, this four, five, six. In the last loop, you're going to crochet four half double crochet in the same loop. One, two, three, four. 
Mm, crazy how it looks. In this loop, we're going to make a slip notch and make a chain. In the same loop, you're going to do two half double crochet. One, two. So this will be our beginning for the bottom sole. And in the next six, you're going to do another half double crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six. And in the next one, you're going to do two half double crochet in the same loop. One, two. And in the next one, one half double crochet. One. And in the next one, two half double crochet. These are our increase for the heel and toes. And in the next one, one half double crochet. And in the next six, you're going to do one half double crochet. So one, two, three, four, five. And in the next one, you're going to do two half double crochet in the same loop. One, two. And in the next one, you're going to do one half double crochet. One. And in the next one, two half double crochet. One, two. And then in the next one, one half double crochet. One. Then we're going to join our sole by making a slip notch. And this concludes my tutorial on how to do soles for baby booties. And this was done with a J size hook. Now it depends on the yarn you use, on the hook you use. Size variate. As you can see, this is a 9 to 12 month. But since this yarn don't stretch as this one. Okay. Everything variates. This is more stretchy. As you can see. You see? More stretchy. This is not so stretchy because it's 100% cotton. If you want to use for 9 to 12 months, you may use a size bigger hook. But it all depends on the yarn and hook. This is a zero to 3, but because the yarn is thinner, the booty came out a little bit smaller than what this is. And this is 100% cotton also. But stay tuned, and uh, my next step will be how to transform our sole into one of our easy to make booties. That will be my next tutorial. So stay tuned. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Thank you.